Hey guys, Jesse here, playing the Dark Pictures Anthology, Little Hope. Okay, so, uh, we are going to, I already checked the settings, so we're going to play this thing. You remember this is the second in a series of spooky ass games. The first one, Man of Medan, which you can uh, find in the in the channel. So, uh, new story. Uh, to play with point and click using a mouse press. I'm gonna play with the mouse. Here we go. Little Hope Roadside Diner, 9.42 p.m. Present Day <clears throat> The book said the wild magic Driving down this spooky ass road. Oh, missed. Ah, more missed. Okay, police car here. Detour. Okay, what's going on? Yes, hello? Thanks for pulling over. Sure. Something wrong? We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. We've had to close the road. Oh. You're right. Okay. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yes. A little bit. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Okay, we're going to Little Hope. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Can just make it through the old wood, I mean, wood bridge. any harder it'll wear away to nothing how long have you been sober a few days shy of three months impressive i heard the first 90 days are the toughest and roughest i know it doesn't add up but i get something from holding on to this you're now entering little hope we're going the wrong way it's fine just a quick detour it's not fine calm down Oh, please, John, could you not patronize me? Could you keep it down, please? Oh, crap. Yep. That's what happened with this spooky little girl in the middle of the road. Bearing updated. A girl stood in the road caused the bus driver to lose control and crashed the bus. Okay, so we play, pr press the middle mouse button and we get the bearing thing, you know. 
The little girl. This is a bearing. Okay. Yeah, and the bus is kind of busted. Snowing now. It was not snowing a moment ago. Stop it, James. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Okay. Can you believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after ten beers. Indeed. Reverend Carson held her back after prayers today. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together family. is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough You're this is You're not the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. Okay, some tension here, you know. This guy's kind of drunk. There's the little girl. Not tonight. No way. I think she was the one, like, in the vision or whatever happened that caused the bus to crash. Bonnie Tramp. What is that? Anthony. Clark Family Home, Massachusetts. Late. She always is these days. Um, I give her a break, you know. At least one of us is out having a good time. Give her a break. Yeah. It's him I'm worried about. That guy's no good for her. All that new age bullshit. Reminds me of some creepy cult. Oh. Some hippies or something. He came in last week. We okay. shot the breeze a little bit. I like him. Did you, did you shot that the breeze? Classic. Did he pay Legendary extra? Vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? Yeah, don't paw at it. You're a creepy little girl. You see? Okay. Uh, hey, Bigfoot! Hey, don't step on the. Damn vinyl, will you? Hey, it was an accident, bro. There's no need to be so tough on her. It was an accident. Yes. Everything Megan does is an accident. Yes. I don't want her going Alma on us, you know, like in the Fear games. She might be like a powerful psychic for all we know. That's why she's so creepy. Damn ice. Okay, someone's trying to. Hello? I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. Okay. Hey, bro. How's things? It's, it's you know, the so fighting. He's been pumping iron again? Yes. They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Uh, Dad's been drinking. Dad's been drinking. Who could have guessed it? They're always fighting these days, getting predictable, like a record that keeps playing over and over. Dennis, for the 10 million time, will you shift that shit of yours up into the hey, attic? Some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought after collection. Yes. You know, some vinyls. They're pretty good. I think she was a marine sergeant of past life. Maybe. Okay, so these are all like siblings? Scrolled up his ass. Uh. Dennis is being Dennis, you know? He's a menace. Just Dennis doing what he's good at. Being really Dennis. Yes. Surprise. Mm. That's the actor from, like, um, Maze Runner, you know? Hey, Dennis. Ah, oh, creepy little girl. Hey! Not now, sis. I'm busy. Yeah. Busy. A little bit busy. Huh? Hey! Quit acting crazy! Yeah, you see? 
So some psychokinetic action going on there. Huh? Oh! Jesus! You scared me, sweetheart. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Yeah, sorry, Megan. You're a little bit creepy, you know? That's, that's, that's the main issue at this point. You're gonna go Alma on us. Ah, she has a key. Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? I just upset someone. They sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. She's, she's kind of creepy. Picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's the little princess anyway? Um. Concerned. Probably better to leave Megan alone. As her big sister, it is my sworn legal duty to check in on her. Right, sure. Okay, like so... Like the law around here. Yeah, sister. She went upstairs. I'll go find her. So, their brother and sister, okay. But I'm thinking maybe not, you know, like the, the sons of picks to pick up, move to examine, press to put down. Okay, pick it up. Okay, we can examine this. Can I just put it down? Oh. Okay. He didn't have some water here. What are you watching? Present time with the heartbeat. Button might change to during keep calm. Okay. So. Pressing. Okay, keep calm. We did it. Judging from the remote, this is maybe the 80s. Yeah, this <clears throat> you need to keep an eye on your little sister. Yeah. Mom is real worried about her. Reassuring. It's okay, Dad. Tanya's checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? The devil himself would struggle with you guys. Hey, what's this sassiness, bro? I mean, dad. Press to move to a location. Press to stop moving. Press at the screen edge to move in that direction. Okay. So if I move over here, I want to stop. I do this. Can't move anywhere, anywhere else. Like over here. Can I examine something over here? Like, can I go over here? Oh, we can examine something. Shroud of Innocence. Pick it up. Perfect distraction from this madhouse. Yes, I must read for, uh, for anyone with an interest in the Salem Witch Trials of 1692. Shroud of Innocence. I want to write that down, you know, 1692. Okay, what else do we have? I would, I would rather move with the, you know, like the keys, but I'm guessing the New England witch trials. Okay, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a, a pattern. The New England witch trials. Oh, I can move with this, you see? Now I can move with the keys. Little Hope Museum, 799. Interesting. I wonder if I can examine the other book again. No, the, the other book. Okay. Shroud of Innocence. Turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it. Come on. No. Okay, that's pretty much it. 
I can look at the window, but first let me see if there is anything here. Can I can I get a drink, you know, like a beer? No? Okay, I'm gonna inspect over here. Uh there may be hidden information. Okay. I'm not seeing any hidden information right now. I see like the tire with some stars. It's dark and it's snowing. Okay. Anthony, where the hell are you? Uh, I, I am Anthony, Anthony. Where are you, goddammit? Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off. What, what's going on? Anthony, Why is she there? You could there? be right about my family. She's talking to someone. I think so too. Yes. Yeah. Look at this. Look at Tanya. this. What's going on? That little brat locked me out. It's fucking freezing. Well, jump. Creepy, creepy doll. The shadow with the in. things. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. Oh crap. Oh crap. Okay, kick the door in, bro. Shit! Megan! You in there? No time to be subtle now. Uh oh. The kitchen's on fire! Are you fucking serious? Yeah. It's a highly combustible kitchen. Not Where going the hell well. is everybody? Anthony, help! Jump! <coughs> Come on, bro. It's not such a big fall. Help! Oh. Anthony! Hey! Up here! What the fuck are you doing up there? I got trapped in the attic. Get to the balcony! Anthony, help! Okay, break something, bro. You use the shovel. I saw a shovel there. Hey, Dad. I can't breathe. Okay, this is not going well. You see the creepy girl there. Tanya help Megan. Uh, I gotta help Megan because Tanya can just jump, you know? Tanya, hold on! I gotta get Megan out! Megan! Oh crap. And she's on fire now. She went down. Okay, let's go help Tanya. What are you doing? Why are you going inside? You didn't just jump. Okay, bad decisions all over the place. Come on, bro, it's not such a... 
huge fall. Come on, come on. Ah, accepted you fall there. You know? Yeah, you fall there, you're screwed. Well, that was a short game. Yes, hello. Perfect safety matches. What have you done? Mom, stop! Total party kill. Well, that was little hope. You know, short game. If you ask me. Ooh, same intro from the first game. Let's see if this music is not copyrighted, because it is awesome. Now the curator is going to show up. All big and bad. Just see. I really hope I don't have to replace this music. Should be okay, the first video is okay. There you go. Hey, bro. I'm back. How are you? Hello. What's up? And welcome back. Yes. I have a new story for you. It's very different to the last. Okay, good. Remember the first one, Man of Meta, available on the channel. Okay, yeah, that's a that's a good story. <laughs> Disconcerting, no? Yes. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. Okay. This particular story isn't fully fleshed out. It's only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Same as the first one, bro. The fire. No, there was nothing you could have done about that. I, I, What's happened has happened. Yes. Or has it? I don't know. Anyway, look to the future, I say. Life's but a walking shadow, eh? Hey. You are about to enter... I'm over here, bro. ...a confusing, perhaps disturbing world. How disturbing might depend on what you choose to believe, and how confusing on the path you choose to take. Hmm. Cryptic. There are an infinite number of directions in which one could travel. We seldom have all the information that we'd like, but we have to choose our path nonetheless and hope that we get the clarity and the outcomes that we want. As in life, your decisions will matter. The choices you make will affect others. Okay. You've seen how the story starts. So much death. It was a TPK, bro. Total How particle. many more deaths is entirely up to you. It depends on the decisions that you make. Okay. What are you? Rational? Emotional? 
Do you trust your head or your heart? We'll see. There is no right answer. Sometimes one is best and sometimes the other. My advice for what it's worth is to thine own self be true. Okay. But uh, <laughs> I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. You could help a little. I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Mm -hmm. Not my place, apparently. But I am apparently allowed to share wise words from great storytellers that have gone before, where I feel that that would be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you go. Mm -hmm. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future, something that may or may not happen. Use them. They might help you. Okay, omens. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. Thanks, bro. Thanks. Mm. I do enjoy a good funeral. You're kind of weird, bro. You're kind of weird. Same as in the first game. But it's okay. So. Funeral. Snow. There was some sort of crow or raven, never could, you know, like, distinguish them. None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. Because of the creepy little girl. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together. For eternity. In God's loving embrace. Yes. Now this is Tanya's uh, date. He is the sole survivor. Like I said, it was a TPK. Total party kill. Some atmospheric disturbances. What? You still alive? What? But now it's Andrew, 18 college students, anxious and detached. Okay. Taylor, 22 college student, headstrong and sensitive. John, 43 college professor, rational and overbearing. Isn't this the father? Where the hell's Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. Instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? Compassionate Terz. I'm going to be compassionate, you know? How is he doing anyway? He doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. Okay. Let me see. There was a relationship update. Current objective tried to call for help. Flirtatious, sensitive, hopeful, deceitful is locked. No pictures. The little girl bearing. There's like a lot of secrets here. Some are connected to others. Taylor. Hopeful. Sensitive. Okay. John Taylor. Taylor assisted John with checking on Andrew after the bus crash. Angela. Is this a mother? This is really weird, you know? Destruction and creation are the same thing after all. 